Hello, Dwarf Vegan here, back with another episode of War on the Sea. We are still hunting this cargo ship fleet. And uh, apparently we have spawned in in a really bad position here. So I'm going to go ahead and spin the old spinner around here. Hopefully we don't get noticed by this destroyer <laughs> right next to us. I mean, that's, that's a pretty crappy spawn right there. Pretty crappy spawn. Let's see what we got here, though. I didn't even look and see what happened with the Atlanta. It looks like she may not be with us anymore. It may have scuttled her. Now there she is. She's here. She's in bad shape, though. She's in bad shape. The heavy moderate damage. Yeah. So, we also have here destroyer. Another cruiser here. Cargo ship and a patapsco. I guess the other one was scuttled. Yeah. So the question is, who am I going to target now? I think I'll target number one here. Let's go ahead and identify her. Northampton? Perhaps. Perhaps it is the Northampton. Yes. Yes, it is. Well, Northampton, it is time for you to meet your fate. We're going to sink this cruiser. Uh, Atlanta is already heavily damaged, so she's got nine eight-inch guns. Golly, a tough old gal. All right, let's uh, let's see if we can get a beat on her. Get our solution built up. And we might get some secondary hits as well. With some of these other fellas. Lynn, what you doing? Just spin around and see if you can help keep an eye on these fellas for us. Might be able to get some secondary hits as well on this guy. Are they breaking? Oh, I guess Tapsco here is dead in the water. Wow. That's going to be easy money for me. Might shoot one at her. One torpedo manually at her. If I can get a good beat on her. Awfully risky. We are close to that destroyer, man. Luckily, it's... Still early in the morning, and uh, visibility is low. Forty-eight percent. Northampton's about to get wrecked. I'm gonna fire five at him. We'll go one degree spread. All right, and then we'll fire one shot at. Up to 79 percent. Let's keep spinning. I am so worried about this guy right here. Awfully close. 81 percent. Stressful. I like think 80% is as good as we're going to get. Fire. And then I want to fire manually. Down here. And him. Fire. Then I want to dive. Run silent. Get the heck out of here. Uh, do you really want to run towards the destroyer? No. I'll run this way. What is that manual torpedo doing? What? Where are you going? I told you to fire down that way. Well, that's a fail. Where's it? Where's it going? Oh my god! I hate firing torpedoes manually. It always does something weird. It doesn't make sense. 
All right, well, Northampton's about to get an unpleasant surprise. Looks like they are all on target. That's good. There we go. Northampton, say goodnight. Boom. 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 Wow. That is brutal. That is total and utter destruction, my friends. That's got to be a critical, critical, yeah. Yeah. That's, that, she's gone. She's gone. And she sunk. All right. I could, uh... Try to sneak out of here and come back around and fire at number five. Or who is who is that idol down here? Number seven. Wait for the rest of these guys to keep going, but uh, that'll take forever. I'm not super keen on it, to tell you the truth. So I'll probably just go ahead and leave. And uh, I think the Fear Talking group will be able to finish these guys off. So. Go ahead and retreat. Okay. Bye-bye, Northampton. Nice. They are going to be defenseless against the upcoming strikes here. Okay. Well, I mean, not, not defenseless. They'll still have destroyers, but what are you doing? Going back. You're, you're dumb. You're dumb. Oop, 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 what happened? I hit the wrong button. That's what happened. Okay. Suki's got some action. Their escorts have not arrived just yet. Give them a chance to find us. All right. That was your chance, pal. Okay. So these guys are all on their way to. Escort, okay. Why don't you just go to the Mizuki? It's closer, okay. So here's the task force here. They're gonna go on down there. These guys are on their way. These guys may not be able to make it. Yurtaka, what are you doing? Quit hugging the coastline. It takes so much longer. Six hours before they can get there. Glenn, keep an eye on them. Guys, you might have to expend some more torpedoes. Okay. Ah. Suki's got another engagement. Do 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 do. Alright. They're just not able to find us for some reason. I'm fine with that. Should I go ahead and go into another engagement with this guy? Still got 11 torpedoes. I think I will. Go into another engagement with the submarine. We got our Glenn up. Tell us what's what. Just hang in there, Glenn. Alrighty. Head this way. Now one of these guys is is uh, crippled, right? Caps go. Yep, there he is. Number six. So I might just wait and um, run up on that Patapsco. After all, his escorts are gone. Sink him right quick. One torpedo should do it. Alright, Glenn. Circle. Yep. They're just passing old Patap School by here. Atlanta's not in good shape either. What's she doing? 
desperately trying to dodge that boiler. <laughs> I'll get rid of your guy's problem. Just keep on steaming. Keep on steaming. Let's see. 10,000 yards. About to close a little bit. I think I got the range on that, actually. If you look at the Japanese I-15, uh, yeah, that 13,000 yards on the Top 95s, long lance torpedo. So I, I technically is within my range, but I only got a 40% solution on it at the moment, so. I wish they would just head on out. Quit circling the wagons. But if they decide to circle the wagons, I'll just fire a big spread in there and just see what I can destroy. Lana is going to ram her. She's like, we'll scuttle her. <laughs> we'll scuttle both of us. <laughs> oh, man. What is happening over there? What a mess. I'd love to just shoot some torpedoes in there right now. Okay, I might just do it. They're just they're just all waiting to get destroyed at this point. If I throw a three degree spread in there, I might be able to get some of these guys. They're just all clustered around like a bunch of idiots. What if I go four degrees? Should I aim at at Atlanta or Tesco? I think I'll uh, shoot. I want to sink that oiler for sure. But I'd love to sink Atlanta and maybe some of these destroyers that are circling around as well. What are you guys doing? Okay. Uh, decisions, decisions, decisions. Let's fire at the, this, this ship here. With the uh, same spread. Go ahead and classify her as perhaps go. Go. We're going to go ahead and angle just a little bit. Go. We're just going to fire a spread in there and see what happens. Big old nasty spread in there. Fire. And come to a full stop. Scope down, dive. You can go ahead and uh, you can go ahead and keep reloading. This won't sink this Patapsco, but. We might get some hits on some of these other guys. These are, these are all clustered together like a bunch of idiots. I don't like the way that's going though. I wish it was more angled this way. If I had more trust in the manual firing, I would have fired that with manual, but it seems to be like completely unreliable. As we saw in the last firing. Yeah, this is not gonna work. Idiot. You missed a golden opportunity here. Ah, annoying. I sometimes just really despise this game. Alright. I'm gonna try manual one more time. With just one torpedo. Let's see if we can finish off the Patapsco here. God, that's annoying. Should have just fired at this. Ugh. Let's just see if we can at least get some hits on this guy. Ugh, it's annoying. We'll, we'll let this guy fire up to two torpedoes and we're going to fire. All 
Alright, fire. There they go. Torpedoes away unless that destroyer intercepts them. This should be a sink. It's not moving. I don't know how you can miss. Firing at the Glen. Get out of there, Glen. Okay. Don't tell me you're gonna miss. I'm gonna be really mad. He's not even moving. You can't hit a non-moving target. No, I'm not. I can't see the freaking torpedoes. There they are. Yep, miss. Both of them. Oh, for crying out loud. I've shot eight torpedoes now. <laughs> to no avail. To no avail. Ugh. Guess I'll try manual. I got one more torpedo loaded. Alright. I'm gonna try manual fire. Right in the kisser. Hold on. All right. Manual. Fire. Boom. Let's do it. Look, it's doing it again. Look at that. Why is it doing that? What am I doing that's making it do that? I mean, I'm assuming it's something I'm doing in that. I don't know. Now I'm about to send all these guys back home. Get torpedoes. It's really annoying. Look at this. It's going off in the boo. They're finally leaving the, the area there. So... <clears throat> I just let them leave. We'll just creep up on Patapsco here and finish him off. Maybe if I get closer, I can get a hit. <laughs> Ridiculous. I sometimes just really hate this game. <laughs> I just really hate it sometimes. It's just so... Ugh. Frustrating. It's so close to being a good game. I mean, it's a good game. It's so close to being a much, much better game. Alright. Up to 80-something percent. I'm tempted to just pop up and fire guns at her, but... I'm afraid these, these guys will blow me out of the water. All right, got our last two torpedoes loaded. We're only 15, 1,700 yards away. I'm tempted just to go down here. And then ankle back around like that so I can get a nice broad shot on her. I don't trust my torpedoes. All right, we're just about in a position to fire here. Just about in a nice, juicy position to fire. Okay. I don't know how we could be in a juicier position at this point. I mean, look at this. Broadside shot. He's not moving. I'm not moving at this point. Neither one of us are moving. Still only got an 89% solution. I'm going to go for it. Torpedoes away. There they go. Let's see. That's a hit. 
That's a hit. That's my last two torpedoes in this sub, so... That's gonna be it for her. But, I do have the Fuhrer Tucker coming down. She sunk. I do have the Fuhrer Tucker coming down. And, uh... She can clean up the rest of these guys. If she can catch them. That's, that's, the, that's the rub right there. If she can catch them. Alright, so this guy here, I-15, is completely out of torpedoes. So, I'm going to set course for home. Them. They are going to do that. I-10, I want you to come back up here and see if you can intercept those guys on there if they try to run. Gertaka's on her way, but she's got another few hours to get there. So, you got four torpedoes left and a little bit of damage. Okay, Jake, come on down this way. See if you can find them. Mitsuki's got another engagement. Of course they do. Do we have some geckos on the way? I don't see anybody at the moment. I'd like to give everybody just a, a couple of seconds to spawn in, but if they don't, they're lost, you know? Oh, they must have spawned in because I, I can't uh, fast forward time. Yep, there they are. What we got here? Oh. Blue forts. The torpedoes. The British. Good British torpedoes as well. Okay. I want you to break. Speed up. I want you to break. Speed up. Alright. It's going to be tricky. They dropped them. Run straight. I think we can miss it here. Keep running straight. I think we're good. It's, oh, we got one too. Nice. It's hard to hit these little boats with torpedoes. Right, let's see if those geckos can finish off that last guy there. They are on their way over. No tally at the moment on the enemy. Okay, here we go. Oh, they got it. Okay. Another one bites the dust. The allies are using up all their land-based aircraft, that's for sure. Okay. Tupac here, he's uh he's gonna sit for a little while. Glenn, keep watching him. Jake, keep watching him. I got anything from here? No. Okay. I-10's on their way up. Rutak is on her way. These guys keep an eye on them. He's got hundred miles left. He's got eighteen miles left. Let's go ahead and launch another aircraft from him. Oh, he's already used his aircraft. Launch one from him then. Lynn, come on up here and take it. Keep an eye on that guy. All right. Come on, door use. Don Roos, whatever. And door use. Green two. All right. Well, Don Roos is not going to make it. Mavises, they should make it. They'll, they'll make it. And he's on uh, whew, he's on that coastline that really slows you down, so that's good. I could send How far is it from Buka? Ah I hate when I hit the wrong button. Hit the wrong slash button and it's like ultra speed. 453. 453. 
Hmm. These nails can get down there. Took them four hours. Wouldn't bring them. Lynn, come down here and check this out. Where's the Mavis is at? There they are. Come on back. Alright, Mavis. I want you to get too close. Don't get too close. Alright. Mavis and I 10. Man, why are you like this? Alright. I need you to turn hard right. Let's go up. Oh my god. Right in their path. Alright, Mavises. I need you to hit the deck quick. possible. I tens. That's the Atlanta. That's a destroyer. Go ahead and target Atlanta, I guess. Go ahead and identify her as the Atlanta. There go. Our right, building up your solution. I want you to go no speed, no speed ahead. Okay. Mavises, how are you doing? You're, you're good. I want you to attack this guy. Go. Actually, you know what? I want one of you to attack this guy. You are going to attack number one. You're going to attack number three. All that's left is destroyers in the Atlanta, which is going to get destroyed by I-10. 99% solution. You got it. R3. All right. Switch over to the number four here. What do you got? Who are you? There you go. Electric, perhaps. Target the Fletcher. There we go. Start building up a solution for that. The first two torpedoes should finish off the Atlanta. Should be a direct kill there. Fletcher, build up your solution for it. Firing up Mavises. Come on, Mavises. I might ought to tell Mavises to speed up. They're going to go. Now they're at 144. Okay. They're flying in full speed. I'll be lucky if they make it in, though. That Atlanta's still active. It's brutal. All right, speaking of brutal, plan is about to get struck, thunderstruck. Plan is about to take one in the face. Yes, sir. Nice. Good night, Irene. She won't survive that. One of them missed. 94%, 97% solution on the Fletcher. She's going to turn. I'm going to go ahead and fire, though. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and tell myself to dive. Silent. Run that way. One of my Mavises just went down. Come on, Mavis. Drop those torpedoes. There you go. Break. Oh, got her. Lana went down. 
Come on. Oh yeah, this is gonna hit her. Nice. Oh yes, beautiful. Lana's going down. Nice. Good, 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 good. This Patapsco is gonna go down. I have no doubt of that. This guy's gonna be safe. Uh, let's continue to run parallel to her. Fletcher might get hit. Torpedoes sometimes skip underneath the uh, keel of a destroyer. Plus, she, I think she sees those wakes. But she's gonna be fine. Yep. Paps goes down. Fletcher is gonna get missed. Okay. Yeah, that's unfortunate. But we did pretty good. How many torpedoes do I have left? Twelve. Okay. I could probably sink this guy, honestly. If I come back up to periscope depth, and I target this guy instead of the Fletcher, I bet I can get a kill on him. I bet I could. Oh, oh let's go. Ah, eh, that Fletcher's gonna have it. He's gonna be coming after me. Don't have any torpedoes loaded. Ah, let's just go. Let's just go. Alright, I'm up to 15 points just from sinking ships in this task force here. So that's, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Okay. Let's continue on with the I-10. Let's just see what we can find here as well. Okay. I-10 got another engagement. Scope up. Perfect, perfect alignment here. This is the Arcturus. Okay. 36, 39. Oh, yeah. We're going to sink her. Let's we'll do three torpedoes. This would be enough. Finish her off. Okay. 96, 95, 98. Alright, let's fire. I'm going to turn parallel to them. Go and dive. Run silent. Let's go down. All right, a sub-heavy episode this episode, but uh, I think it's pretty good. A lot of good work done by the Wolf Pack. All right, here we go. Our final kill with the Wolf Pack for this episode. I think it'll be a kill. I can see the wakes. I can't see the wakes. There they are. I'm really struggling to see the wakes nowadays. There you go. There you go. Two hits. Two out of three ain't bad. Let's see if that'll be enough to finish her off. Are we sitting down on the bottom? No. A little deeper. Oh, look at this. Might get a incidental hit. On this destroyer. Arcturus sunk. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hit her, hit her, hit her. Nice! Nice! Yes! Yes, the Fletcher got an incidental hit. It's two Fletchers, one of them is hit. Nice. Beautiful. 
Heavy, heavy on that Fletcher. Man, we might be able to finish her off. Let's let time pass a little bit and see what happens to her. This other Fletcher is making a bee line for us, though, unfortunately. Let's slow down. Just be quiet. I'm running silent already, right? I'm down on the bottom, running silent. I'm not on the bottom, but just about a tip, test dip. Let's see what happens to this Fletcher here. The other Fletcher's looking for us, but doesn't know where we're at. Lynn, get out of here. looking. We don't know where to look. This Fletcher's still burning. Fly around that way. We don't know where I'm at. That's good. Oh, I lost the eyes on that other destroyer. Darn. Okay. I have to get my blend back over there so I can see where they're at. There they are. Got three torpedoes left. I can pop back up. Pick him out. It's far away, so. I'm gonna go ahead and pop back up. Periscope dip. Up scope. Okay. We're at 4,000 yards. I lost sight of him. Go in, come back. Now I kind of lose sight of him. He's got a huge. Smoke coming up at him. Alright, 70%. Fire one torpedo, zero degree spread. Let's think a little closer. Yeah, let's keep that in there. Still going six knots. He's still burning. Nope, he's done burning. Okay. He's up to seven knots now. I'm still catching him. Should I? Up to 90%. 93%. I'm go up to two torpedoes. One degree spread. Fire. Let's see if we can finish this Fletcher off. It's up to, going up to 10 knots now. Yeah, I think we're going to miss. She changed speed right after I fired, so. I do have one torpedo left. Let's see. We'll see. We might get her. <laughs> Subs hunting destroyers. How do you like that? That's what you call action. Action Jackson. Where's the dang wakes at? There they are. One here, one there. That one definitely missed. This one might hit. If I would have went uh, zero degree spread, they probably both would have hit. Oh, passed right by him. Yep. Fail. Fail. Dang. I should have just went with a zero degree spread. Alright, well, I could go ahead and fire that last torpedo. I don't really feel like it. Well, don't you though? Yeah, let's try it. Let's try one more time. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Looking pretty promising. Looking pretty promising. Angle's pretty good. Oh God, it's gonna, is it? It's gonna slip right by? Nope. Is it? Is it? Oh! 
inches. Well, you know, feet, but still. Bang. That was close. All right. Let's go ahead and get out of here. We went in and sunk the Arcturus. We did heavy, heavy on the Fletcher. And I think we're in good shape to come back up here and patrol. I don't think I want to continue to chase that guy at the moment. He is going to, uh, he's going to make it back home. But uh, the Furitaka is going to go ahead and come on down and help patrol in this area. And then we'll um, be able to catch whoever else tries to sneak up in there. The task force with supplies is going to come down and upgrade Shortland Islands to level 3 port. And then we'll be able to bring people back to there to, uh, to rearm instead of having to go all the way back to Rabao. But I hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure and hit that like button. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.